Hi, this video shows how to adapt an uh, ASP um, application, ASP.NET Core. Uh, this uh, border on my application, when you have a default application, uh, you will always see that there is on the left margin and the right margin on somewhere on your site. And you don't know, sometimes you don't know how to fix it. So what we first do is we, we have a look into uh, the F12 developer uh, view of our site and you will see that when you hover above this uh, the top uh, elements so this is a diff container on the uh, on that block then you always have the problem you will always see that you have here a, a container class so this is the container class around there and somewhere in around there you will see there's uh, whatever you do in this container class there's uh, it's always limited to the left and right side so this is the, the border the, uh, the margin comes from the container class so how to fix it uh, for this you go to your application so this is my application in the background it's an uh, my uh, ASP.NET Core application and inside there you will see it's a, it, you see it's a, a MVC so there's a controller there are views but it's always the same you have here a shared files and inside the shared files you have the underscore layout dot CS HTML so when I whenever I open a file like this one the article or articles list then there is in the top the layout which uh, opens before anything uh, the it includes the layout block layout.cshtml and inside there you will see that's the head and the body that's what we've seen there so when we go there we see there's the head there's the body and then you have the header and inside there there's the uh, container glass and now what we have to do is uh, we, go, we won't go into that deep. We go take the body uh, and inside there, we first may change the container to container and then dash. And you see there is a, that's a, uh, that's a bootstrap class. So there's a, that small icon bootstrap. And then we change the container to container fluid. Then we save it. And when you saved it, uh, we open now the our file, uh, we refresh our file in here, and now you see that the big block is away. And now we do something further. You see that the nav bar inside there uh, is not uh, sized to the maximum. So, what we do now is we have here the head, head, body, and then there's the header. And inside the header, we have also this one again. And there's the, the nav bar is blocked in a container class and uh, CSS, CSS file container class. And the container is from Bootstrap. And now we say dash and also container fluid. And this is also taking another style. Now, when I refresh it, now we have this big block and I would prefer to say here that I make a div block here around where I set all my uh, advertisings and all that stuff to the left and right side.